Choose Freedom, choose adventure, choose leisure. Hi campers, welcome back to the Choose Leisure Most Home channel. My name is Mark and Dawn, my colleague, we are both your handover technicians down here at Choose Leisure Most Homes in Canterbury, Kent. Dawn, what are we luxuriating in today? Oh, we are reveling in the gloriousness that is the Catargo Chic S Plus. This particular model happens to be the i64 XLQB. QB, a meaning queen bed, so mm. which is great. You've got a lovely size bed at the back there. Mm. Yeah, this is built on an Iveco chassis. It's an automatic and is described as the powerhouse of the liner class. Yes, it is. And it is weighing in at 6.7 tonnes, so you'll definitely need a C1 licence to drive, drive this vehicle. Yeah, yeah, which is great. And it's a lovely big old beastie. We love it. And um, we're going to do a quick review on it, so follow us around. So unusually, because this vehicle is the way it's parked in the showroom today, we're going to just going to give you a quick kind of guide along the outside, but everything packed with Cathargo as you'd expect. Um, so we're going to start with the scooter garage. So your scooter garage actually has a load capacity of 450 kilograms. It is. And so I suppose that's being based on the 6 and 6.7 ton van. You've got so much payload, haven't you? Yeah, exactly. The other thing that's quite interesting about this particular model is it's got a high towing capacity. So it can actually tow up to three and a half ton. Wow. Crikey. That's a, that's a good old load, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. So you could probably tow a motorhome by a motorhome. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Yeah, one for him, one for her. Brilliant. All the goodies you'd expect with Catargo, so all of your electrics are in the back. Yep. You've so got, got an inverter as well, which will run all of the electric sockets throughout the vehicle. Yeah, your main socket's going to be working yep. for you. So they're not just kind of designated sockets off the inverter, it runs the whole thing. And you've got a nice kind of internal, external kind of shower point just yeah. here. So if you've got anything you want to rinse off or, a, yeah. you know, scruffy little dog or Dirty naughty toy, <laughs> naughty <laughs> child, <laughs> any of those kind of things. <laughs> So we close that back up again. Of course, you've got your mains hookup lead. You've got your cassette of joy with the SOG system. You've also before. got external storage. Yep, and they go right through, don't they, as well, most this of these? This one doesn't, actually. Oh, this okay. one's like a wet locker. Oh, okay. So it's kind of only like a little wet locker. Oh, yeah. Yep, um, boots, however, yeah, yeah, perfect for that kind of stuff. However, this one does. So this is a dual flooring. Oh, yeah. So you've got that underfloor style heating yeah with the vents running under because it's got the Audi heating and the radiators throughout so it does give you an effect of fantastic underfloor heating barbecue point there as well. fantastic. yeah that's a nice addition but when you look at the habitation door now it's got this kind of fob entry uh -huh. okay so it's like a card that you can zap and then it will let you into the habitation Ooh. door without unlocking the whole thing yeah but it's an extra large uh door habitation door, door. Yep. i think they call it safety lux oh cool so it's a really nice and it is Electrics, if I close that up just slightly, it then seals yeah. itself and locks itself in. Heard it, yeah, cool. But look how cool the step is as well. Yeah. This is, <laughs> it's the little things, that's, simple things that it's please me. It's the stuff that we love, isn't it, about this job? So it yeah, goes up like that, it. and Almost then it folds back in on itself. Like a triple folding step. Yeah. <laughs> I just I think that's brilliant. Yeah. Absolutely fantastic. So, um, yes, like I said, because of where we are in the showroom, campus, we're going to go in now. But just look, before you go in, that great big strip light and a yeah. huge awning, awning canopy. Yeah, that's great, isn't it? Fantastic. Talk about home on wheels, that really is, isn't it? It is. It's a proper posh hotel on wheels. <laughs> so come with me. In we go. Look at these beautiful kind of courtesy lights as you come mm -hmm. in. I'm going to have a quick look at those. Look at that. Lovely. Delicious. So along with the elegance and the beautiful, you get the practical. So all of your drains, Correct. conveniently, in one place. Yeah, fantastic. Look at that. You're fresh and your waste drain. Brilliant. Yeah, great. And, and again, loads of stores on this day. Yeah. Super. So there are various different floor hatches throughout this vehicle because the fresh tank and the waste tank are humongous. Yeah. Uh, the fresh tank is 235 <laughs> litres. That's a small swimming pool. <laughs> and then the waste tank is 200 litres. Yeah, great. One so there's various swimming. different hatches throughout, but Fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. come into the kitchen. Oh, my tablet. So with the kitchen, you get this nice kind of extendable <laughs> Design tap. Look at that. spray tap. Yeah, great. So wash your dishes. You get a lovely three burner gas hob. Yeah, those lovely cast iron trivets, which I like. Quality, quality. 
of course you get you an espresso coffee maker yeah yep. super but this little button here uh -huh. locks cool. all of the kitchen and the foot locker so when you're traveling yeah, nothing like can fly open, spring it open like, yeah. great. and oh, of course you've got your feature. oven and grill yeah really and good. then you've got a nice big fridge 153 liters and freezer yeah which great. you can open both from the side yeah cool how many how deep are the cupboards are they an arm are all, they an arm full all, all. oh oh wow. oh that's over yeah. half an arm over that's, half an arm that's, that's about there look over half an arm yeah. deep brilliant we it's like gotta that. Be. i bet those you. front ones are going to be bigger oh yeah be big. yeah i'd put a small golf in those ones <laughs> so just on from your kitchen area you've got this huge great big washroom and shower room and come and have a look at this. Which you can separate off, so it does become a yeah, separate it's a big room old changing room. Isn't it? Yeah, this is a great size. But... So it's got a rain shower, <laughs> big sunflower head rain shower. Yeah, that's great, isn't it? I mean, how yeah. you don't even get that in most hotels. No, exactly. And with <laughs> two hundred odd liters, you know, you know, you can just luxuriate under the oh, can't. Mind you, it's still only ten liters of hot water, so yes, your, you your know, hot water might, yeah, yeah, hot water might run out. Yeah, it'd be cold water bathing. <laughs> You've got a nice towel rail radiator. Yeah. In your nice toilet. And Lovely. And then you have got more wardrobe space which more is where storage. i put the infill cushion oh, yeah. for the infill time being in there is that a ceramic bowl as well uh i believe it is yeah yes nice it ceramic. is yeah heavy duty ceramic bowl which is great that's yeah and again it is really luxury isn't it yeah all, all this lighting is just really designer and finishing and touches it just finished really well yeah okay that's great i do like it Nice little mood lighting on the floor. Actually, those are really practical because there's just enough light, light during yeah. the evening to see where and you're going. And because it is the blue um, tones, it's not so um, in your face, is it, yeah, when you turn exactly. them on? Yeah. Someone told me, I'm not sure if I believe it or not, but someone told me that the blue light doesn't attract uh, flies and images so much. But uh, I don't know if that's true or not, yeah, but I'm be. just putting it out there. If anybody knows any different, let us know. Yeah. So in the back bedroom, You've got the TV up here, yeah. but it moves <laughs> when you close up the privacy screens Fantastic, to yeah. give you a more central viewing position. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So when, when you've got both doors closed and you're private, you can be watching the TV up here. And I'm luxuriating on the bed as we speak at the moment. You can just see the end of it where I'm, uh, where I'm sitting here. But uh, yeah, I'm just laying down on the bed. <laughs> laying down on the job again, yeah. Mark. <laughs> Not a bad gig, is it? Cool. Here we are in the back bedroom really lovely lovely size bed and underneath the bed you actually have some drawer storage which is quite nice yeah and then you've got these two Fantastic. wardrobe spaces either side and again deep yeah. storages and yeah. they pull out so your clothes come towards you as you <laughs> open the door Marvelous. obviously you can flip the bed up now you can't quite see maybe on camera but there is like a slit yeah in the actual mattress yeah, split, so when yeah, it's not yeah. wrapped up of course yep you can a, you can have one side laying flat and one of you sitting up so perhaps you're really? reading or perhaps you're watching the tv and yeah. the other one's got a, one one of you's gone to sleep okay. really nice which is feature, quite a nice little again, feature what a side bed as well i mean it's like huge. Said, queen bed in the qb yeah. the clothes in the title it's just super size isn't it yeah and how easy is that you don't have to put beds nice together every night <laughs> In your front lounge, there's a switch just here that allows you to raise up your lovely 40-inch oh, flat screen uh, yeah, television. Bondish. Yeah, it's very James Bond, isn't it? Very sort of, yes. Wow. So you've got a big old telly there. And then you've got a nice kind of table, which actually, <clears throat> when I get this right, Doubles does up, yeah. extend out. Yeah. So around here somewhere, it might be this lever. side now, there is... A little lever that allows you to Open pull it out and put together. That's great. So you've it? got an extended table, so everyone's got a seat. Multi movable uh, positions as well, which is you great. You can also dim the lights down. Very So if they're too bright. Very cozy. Very cozy of an evening. Look at that. What a lovely place to be. All that lovely checkered leather upholstery with the wooden details. I really like the clocks and like the barometer <laughs> and that. Like a, like a land cruiser, isn't it? Like a, <laughs> like a ship on land. And that lovely curve or that wooden uh, design on the corners there just comes. And I'm quite sure if I can get out now, I've sat down, because, you know, when we say luxuriating on the job, Marky, this is yes. exactly what we mean. Yeah. But 
Wow. These cupboards. Now, look at the size of that. That's pretty much a whole oh, arm. A whole arm. You lose Acres anything. of space. You'll lose anything in there, couldn't you? And there's two lovely, massive, great big roof vents as well. So you've got loads yeah, of natural loads light. Loads of natural in. light coming into Stargazing this. Stargazing as well, because you could be sitting there on your dining room table looking up at the stars. Oh, yeah, nice. Well, wine, yeah. cheese. Cheese oh. fondue. <laughs> oh, salivating. That's all I want, yeah. And above your head, you've got aircon. It's weird back. Up, so you've got yeah. habitation aircon as well yeah. to keep you nice and cool. So if it's a really, really hot, balmy evening and you've got your, your glass of vino and all your cheese and your cold meats and you've got, you know, yeah. a game of poker going on. We're That's not going to say what kind campus because we know what Mark's thinking. <laughs> yeah, brilliant. And what a lovely place to be. Mm. So you've got above the habitation door, you've got all your controls. Again, all nice and neat in one place. Very practical. You've got your... Um, Front blind control for the, yep. the cab blind. Right. Uh, Aldi heating. So yep. check out one of our other YouTube videos because we have actually got a tutorial on that. The wet heating system we love. Then you've got your inverter control. So your inverter, you can either switch on all the time or you can remotely control it. Uh -huh. And then you've got your main habitation control panel. So what's quite cool about this is you can see that the on-off switch is currently red. It's telling you there's something to pay attention to. Yep. And it happens to be in this case, because in the showroom it's brand spanking new, yeah, it's not got any water in it. Sure. Yeah, yeah. But it could be, you know, batteries are getting a bit low or anything but like that. It gives you an indication and then you can say, yeah. right, okay, I've got a red light there. What does that mean? And you can have a look through your panel. And again, because of the way the vehicle's set up and because it is a touring, they want you out about the touring it's set up with all the extra leisure batteries and your inverter and the solar panel and everything like that the pioneering it's spirit got, Dawny, the pioneering spirit yeah it's got a regulator heater yeah great yeah. so it stops your gas bottles from getting yeah. too cold throughout skiing yeah up at altitude uh, and then, of course, you've got your little music note that allows you to, if you want to listen to the radio and you're luxuriating in the rear, uh -huh. that you can actually listen to the radio, or it allows your television to Turns work. the whole entertainment system on for us. Yeah, mm. that's great. Cool. <gasps> wow. Yeah, luxury. Luxury, luxury. There we are. Three luxuries and four. We're counting that one too. But it is, isn't it? It's it just, is. Oh, it's great. It's a great when, we, when we do say that these are like five-star hotels on wheels, that's exactly what they are. They are absolutely tremendous. They're finished. They're practical. They're yeah, beautiful they're to look at. Yeah. And they're something you just want to show off to all your yeah. mates. Come and have a look because it's just brilliant. And with the payload, you know, oh, with yeah. all the practicality of, of all your drains being at hand, it's, they're just so easy to use. Exactly. Like Everything you need to get to is very easy accessible. Your electrics are in the garage. And speaking of garage, scooter garage, 450 kg yeah. scooter garage, plus Tough. you can tow a car up to three yeah, and a half tons. Exactly, yeah, you could be, you could no get, to a, get to a race meeting for the whole weekend, get away for as long as you like. Mm. You've got so much fresh water to take with you as well. Mm. And with a 6.7 ton vehicle, you, you, you don't have to worry about weight, you know, distribution no. or you, you know, how much you take. You just get out there and enjoy the world yeah. in this easy peasy, pioneering and it would be absolutely spirit. fabulous. I mean, what a way to do it in style. Yeah, the pioneering spirit marches on yeah we are Cathago main dealers down there at choose leisure motor homes in canterbury kent we are indeed and we have stock arriving all the time so if this one's not quite what you're after we do have others in the range we can show you please speak to the sales guys yeah have a look on the website www.chooseleisure.co.uk don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel so that you can see us you know luxuriating in other vehicles to come yeah it's a tough gig i hope you like this video and until next time carry, carry on, on camping, camping.